Uh, typically, twice a day. They'll, they'll go up and do services um, on, on two towers a day. You know, some guys are, are quick and they, they can go nonstop, and, and others older guys like myself, it uh, takes a couple stops or three stops to get your breath back again. There's a lot of safety benefits. It's, it's, it's hard wear and tear and, and the risk of slipping and falling on the ladder. And, and all those, uh, all those kind of hazards have been eliminated with the lift. You get in, you close the door, you push the button, and, and up you go. So It takes about six minutes. So um, I can climb just about as fast as, as the lift goes, but uh, it takes me a while to get, get my breath back when I'm up there. So this, I just get out and I'm ready to go to work. For uh, a, a typical um, maintenance, um, the first guy would go up, and he would take the safety equipment and a few small tools and then he'll send the lift back down and then the guy downstairs will load it up with the remainder of the tools and send it up just with the equipment and then the second guy he'll ride up. So it does take three trips to do a, 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 an all day service on the, on the towers but um, it's, it still is. Before we had the lifts it was one guy climbed up and then you sent all the bags up on the chain hoist and then the guy up there would receive them and the, and the second guy would climb up. So it's, it's a huge improvement. And longevity wise, it's, I've been doing this for some time and knees and shoulders and you know, things just wear out. And, and this will, it used to be that being a wind turbine tech was a young man's job. You know, um, and now it, anybody, you know, so as you get more expertise and knowledge, you're more inclined to, to stay.